Hi guys, welcome back. We're here for another room tour here on Disney property today. And this time we are staying at Disney's Art of Animation in a Little Mermaid room here. Uh, we are in room 7651. All right, before we go in real quick, I just kind of wanted to show you the view. We're on the second floor in room 7651. And uh, it overlooks Hourglass Lake right there, as you can see. And if you look through, you can see the Skyliners running. And uh, But let's go ahead and get you in this room and check it out. This is our first time here, like I said. And uh, we already love it. It's awesome. So let me show you guys. First, we're going to start on the left. Uh, we already have our luggage in. The, uh, the theming here in this room, you'll notice, really never stops. Um, you know, you have Sebastian here along with Flounder. They have the Hey Mickey's here now. It's basically your version of uh, Amazon Alexa. Um, behind it, they do have uh, two USB ports, just traditional USB ports there. The plug-ins, you have your phone, kind of some instructions there on how to start with uh, Hey Disney or Alexa. Um, this is a king bedroom, uh, so it only has the one bed. One of the probably the only downfall of this room is there's no couch in here uh, or no sort of sofa or love seat. It's just a couple chairs, but you do have plenty of room here. Um, you'll notice you have the king bed. You have the shell over the top of it right there as a headboard. Uh, the artwork here is Prince Eric. If we make our way on the other side, you do have an end table right here that also has uh, two regular plug-ins as well as two traditional USB ports. And uh, so we're going to make our way back around right here. As you look, you'll see there's a, uh, a curtain that has obviously kind of some of the underwater creatures from the Little Mermaid here. You have octopus on the door. I'm going to be honest with you, I don't know the names of all these characters. Uh, if they have names, if you let me know. Uh, that's my fault for not maybe knowing some of those. You have a nice uh, size TV right here. More plug-ins and ports there. You have, your, um, you have your ice bucket here. You have your coffee maker right here. Again, it's just kind of a, a, a cup coffee maker. It's not your, your full coffee maker with uh, your, your Joffrey's coffee there coffee stirs, uh, sweet and low sugar, half and half, all the good stuff you need for that. Um, and then let me kind of step back and show you this side of the room next to the TV. The mirror is awesome. You have the two lights here. It's a really well lit room. The artwork around it, the different colored fish. And then on the table right here, you see the chairs are uh, shell shaped in the, the back there. So everything is just themed so well here. Uh, you can see some of the music with the words from different uh, songs here, or let me rephrase that, uh, Under the Sea to be specific. So really cool little touches there. Um, you have your trash can and recycle right there. You kind of see the underwater uh, theming here, the, the seaweed or the grass growing there. And then even the floor is themed really well. It's kind of that teal uh, color of water. And then also under the bed, it is, uh, you know, available for storage under there. I have some bags under there already. So you can get your bags out of the way. If it's just going to be two people here, or maybe two people and a small child where you're going to have a crib, you have plenty of room in this room for that. Um, a lot of extra space to move around these drawers. Whoop, we've already put some stuff in there as well. Uh, some electronics things with very deep drawers and then you open this up right here and this is where you have your refrigerator so nice little fridge right there place to keep your drinks and, and water things like that cool while you're there um, and so let's get on into the bathroom here the bathroom there's not a door here in this room it is just a curtain all right so we're gonna open up the curtain here real quick give you a shot of the bathroom everything like i said is just so well themed in here the colors uh, are the colors of water um, you have the the stone kind of bottom right here uh, you have shells up top for your uh for your lights there um as you can see the marble just kind of flows kind of gives you that water vibe here um they don't have the lotion or anything, only the facial soap for H2O right now. I'm not sure how much longer that stuff's going to stick around. A couple outlets, a makeup mirror right there. Hey, everybody, by the way. Um, up top here, you have your extra pillow and blanket. 
You also have a hair dryer up here. You have an iron, you have your ironing board right there. You have your little luggage rack. And then of course you have your safe right here, which is kind of the older, uh, not very deep, uh, stand up style safe right there. And then uh, you do have your full body length mirror right here. And then to show you guys the uh, shower and toilet area. And of course, when you open the door, the theming does not stop. Uh, you have Ariel right there on the, uh, the shower curtain. And as we open this up, this is probably one of the, uh, as far as from a theming perspective, this is one of the coolest showers. It's not just traditional tile, but uh, you know, the thingamabobs all over the place and kind of in, in Ariel's cave right there. Really, really cool. I don't think there's a part of this room that is not themed. You still do have your H2O shampoo, conditioner, uh, and body soap right there. Um, you have your towel on the ground right there for the towel to put on the ground to step on when you get out. And so, uh, yeah, let me show you one last quick little view here of the room from the uh, bathroom area. And so if you book a little mermaid room here, you kind of know you expect it to be themed, but, uh, and this is our, like I said, this is our first time staying here. And uh, even as just two adults, like it's done really, really well. If you're a fan of Little Mermaid, definitely uh, stay here. If you can, uh, if you can swing it or if you can find availability for it, um, it's really nice. All right, I know this was kind of a quick room tour here this evening. We got in a little late. Uh, but we're just like ecstatic with this room. It's really awesome, really like it. Um, the theming, I would say this is probably uh, the best value resort room. I know this is not cheap for value standards, but it is considered a value. And this is probably the definitely the most well-themed room. And uh, like I said, we like the king bed layout. So I think it's the first time we've ever had the king bed layout as well. Right, Therese? Yes. <laughs> yeah, so it just, it really gives a lot of space not having that, uh, the couch or the, the hideaway, I mean the uh, Murphy bed here. So anyway, if you're still with us and uh, you enjoyed this quick tour, uh, please consider liking and subscribing to our channel. Uh, please check out some of the other videos uh, that mean a lot to us, help out our channel. We hope you all have a great evening and uh, we'll see you soon.